A few weeks back, a former major league pitcher that you may know from seeing the videos circulate the internet where he throws the ball and a cloud of feathers explodes as he kills a pigeon, was spotted at an NFL game of all places with a giant camera, you know, the big long telescoping ones. And of course, this led to a lot of speculation and people going online and realizing this guy has a freaking photography business now. And his shots are really good. And best of all, his logo is literally a bird. It's what he's known for, may as well. And I have to say, I thought it was really cool at first that he'd had this opportunity come that, you know, that he, he, you know, he was well known for that video back in the day and now he's getting attention again. And then I realized, Oh my God, it was a publicity opportunity. Like there is no way on earth that was not planned, but it was beautifully done. He took a giant freaking camera with a huge lens that he knew was going to get attention. He did it when he had the logo set up, the website set up. He had solid stuff for people to look at. And he went to a place that he knew people who would know who he was were at an NFL game. Brilliant. I want to encourage you. I've spent so much time uh, trying to come up with a PR stunt for our company, as well as for other individuals. And, and we'll do brainstorming sessions to come up with PR stunts for people. But I want to remind you, sometimes we think we have to do like, you know, the giant duck that was floating around Canada for a while. We think we have to get big like that. That duck costs, you know, hundreds of thousands of dollars to make and set loose and permits, et cetera, et cetera. And we think, oh my God, it's just out of reach. Well, maybe it's not. Sometimes it's not. Sometimes it's just making sure that everything is set up on the back end so that when people look you up, they like what they see. Two, doing something that you know is going to get a little attention in a place where your audience is hanging out and then letting it go. Not every PR stunt's going to work and that's okay. But find something to do. Start small. Start really small and hope it fails. <laughs> Because the first one you do is probably not going to be phenomenal, but you'll learn a lot. And if it does happen to take off, great job. But the whole point of this is to remind you to stop stressing about coming up with the perfect marketing strategy, the perfect PR stunt, the perfect thing to do to get media attention. Just put something out there because trust me, done is way better than perfect.